Hi everyone, this is Sammy, and today I'm going to show you how you can make your own crochet hooks. For this one I used the handle of a wooden spoon, and this is a pencil, and this is a chopstick. So let's get started. I'm going to show you how easy it is to make any size crochet hook. When I place this chopstick here, I can see three lines, so that means that it's seven millimeters. And a pencil is also seven millimeters because how you'll know what size hooks you're making. And you're going to need something to cut it with. So this is just a very inexpensive saw that I bought at the dollar store. You could use that. Or you could just use a plain razor knife. And you're going to need some sandpaper. You'll have to get this rounded out. So you're just going to sort of whittle at it there. I've just got my piece of wood on an old telephone book. So just whittle it down. I just want it to be like that and we're going to sand that off after. So now we're going to make the section for the hook. I'll start about a half an inch up. Just do one little slit like that and then come over here and fix it there. And I'm just going to keep doing that larger and larger. like that. Now you kind of want this to slant in so I'm just going to make a few more lines there so that when you grab a hold of the yarn it has sort of a little hook section there like that the yarn has a place to hold on to. Now it chipped there a little bit but I'm not going to worry about that. I'm going to sand that down. I'm just going to trim it off a little bit. So now I'm just going to bring my sandpaper over and I'm just going to sand it until it's nice and smooth. Like that. And then I'm just going to fold a piece of the sandpaper and I'm going to get in here and get this all nice and smooth. Now this is a little bit long, so I'm just going to trim this down a little bit more and then sand it again. Well, that looks better. You don't want this part to be too long. So now I'm going to sand this down again. Okay, so that is finished. As long as it feels smooth, it's great. And it wouldn't matter that there's a black lead there if you're just going to work with dark colored yarn. But I'm just going to coat it with um, nail polish, some clear nail polish. It doesn't have to be clear. It can be any color. And I'm just going to give that a good coating. And that's all there is to it. That's how easy it is to make your own crochet hooks. And if you don't have any of these things to work with, you can actually go outside and cut a branch from a tree. As long as it's a good sturdy wood like maple, you should be able to make a strong enough crochet hook. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, please click like. Bye for now.